We're jumping back in talking more about Space Marine 2 because it looks like this week is going to be the big week. The big patch may be dropping. So let's jump in, let's talk about this, and let's talk about what needs to happen and what is about to happen with Space Marine 2. So let's start with the actual big patch itself, which is looking to be dropping this week as I'm recording this video. The reason why I'm stating this week is because of this image in the background right now. Over on the official Space Marine 2 Discord, one of the developers, which is in the pink name, Sister Hyla, hopefully I'm pronouncing that name right, responded to a chap called Nico asking, do you have a date for the patch? And they put later this month and it basically says like in a week or less now this was last week if i'm not mistaken thursday or friday last week so it's looking like this week potentially next week within the next two weeks we're going to be getting that next big content patch for space marine 2 and for those of you who are unaware of what content is about to drop with this patch image in the background right now this is from the roadmap this is the season 2 content patch so you got to get a brand new pve mission apparently in that pve mission they're supposed to be bio titans if that is true then that sounds absolutely incredible there's going to be that brand new level difficulty i know there's been some complaints of some people saying the game feels too easy now Hopefully, this new difficulty makes it harder for you. We're going to get a brand new weapon, the Neo Volkite Pistol. I'm personally interested to see how that performs because it's kind of like a, a microwave heat gun. That's how it's described in the lore. But the big thing, of course, if you're in it for the rule of cool, which I normally am, it's the Dark Angels. They're getting introduced with a bunch of brand new skins. You've got to get the new champion, cosmetics packs, and the weapon skin. Now, if you've seen some of the data mine stuff, already you kind of know what's going to be coming but we're going to get more successor chapters with the dark angels and more weapons like power swords and stuff and it's been spoken about before that the champion is going to be for the bulwark it's going to have this awesome looking robed dark angel model where you can take it in the or pve or pvp games and look absolutely incredible i am excited for this i am a big dark angel fan are they loyalists are they not loyalists of course they're loyalists i'm only playing dark angel players uh, but yeah i'm really excited to get this out and to see what they add into the game one thing i just want to talk about slightly before we move on to the next subject is with the last update they took away the gold there's no more main gold in the game. Developers, please, my reclaimers of dawn, they're not existent anymore. Give me gold armor back in this game. Now, even though that big content update is coming, there's also other things as well. Again, I'll put the image in the background so you can read it along with me. Upcoming content, they put this in the newsletter recently, and it says a hot fix will arrive very soon. It mostly intends to fix crashes and improve stability. Can I just say, as someone who's been playing this game from the start, I personally think the stability in multiplayer has gone down. Like, at the start, I was getting no disconnects. Now, as I'm playing, it's like every couple of games, I get disconnected, and I have to restart the game to get back into PvP games. So, I'm definitely one person who wants more stability in this game. I know there's a lot of people who are still getting crashes when it comes to certain cutscenes and stuff like that. I've said this from the start. I would prioritize getting this game working for as many people as possible rather than putting new content in the game. I can always wait for new content, right? I want as many people playing as possible. Many people jump into the PvE modes, the PvP games. I want as many people purging in Space Marine 2 as we can get. So developers, don't feel bad prioritizing getting the game working for the general player base, okay? We can all wait for new content. Well, I can wait for new content. Hopefully you can wait for new content if we get the game in a best playable state for the general population. Um, the next thing it says, in future, expect quality of improvements, additional customization features, such as new calls for lenses. So I don't think the lenses are gonna be coming in the next update patch. I would hope that they are, but the way that's well the, the way that's stated i don't see that and that goes for the 4k texture pack as well i don't think that's going to be the next content update hopefully it is because i want to replay the game um in a co-op mode with with my friends and film it all and stuff like that and have that 4k texture pack um to show off to you chaps on this channel 
as I'm recording this video right now, officially, the game hasn't been out for a month. I think two more days and then it's officially been out um, for a month and we've had a couple of patches. We're about to get that first big content patch as I just mentioned at the start. There's still a lot of fixes that needs to happen in the game. I know a lot of people keep leaving comments on my videos. Hey Varak, what about Linux users? We're having trouble. There's this crash. There's that thing. Um, lost progression. I get it guys. I know there's a lot of issues with this game at the moment. The only thing I can suggest is going over to the Focus website and post your concerns in the Space Marine 2 section on their forums. That is maybe the best place to get the attention of the developers. A lot of people think like I have a direct connection to Focus and Sabre. I don't. I'm on Games Workshop's naughty list, right? These companies are not allowed to talk to me. Look at me. Even say my name, right? I am the Voldemort of Games Workshop. So I appreciate you guys coming to me to try and reach out to the developers, but I just can't do that gentlemen so please if you can if you have a problem go over to their forms and post it over there and hopefully the developers will get back to you and come up with an issue to fix your problem hopefully this is the start of a lot more content coming for space marine 2 i've spoken about this before this game is the flagship it is the moby dick it's the big whale right it's the favorite primark it's the rogal dawn of the emperor's like sons it's the favorite so we're probably going to get a lot more content going towards the end of this year starting next year even more stuff in between these roadmaps and um i can't wait for it more content more maps more hopefully classes more um just yeah everything more weapons let's do it let's make this game the best thing since the imperial fist were made thank you for coming thank you for watching if you've got any thoughts feedback anything like that post it down below and i'll do my best to try and answer them down there see you have a great day and bye bye